So I made a junk journal for one of my friends and coworkers, and she is a nurse and mama, and she just had baby number two, not that long ago. And um, I just thought this book was perfect because we both are also lactation consultants, and this book was written by somebody from La Leche League. And so I put a little ribbon closure here to be able to tie it off. And then I have a nice little um, fabric, which I thought kind of coordinated with the cover. And I apologize, I don't have a tripod. So um, I kept the ends kind of frayed on purpose. And, um, and what's kind of cool is when I found this book, it's also an autographed copy. So I thought that was pretty special. Anyhow, I am going to do a flip through and I apologize for being a little bit jumpy. Okay, so here is that um, that signed paper. And so I'm just gonna kind of do our little flip through. Um, I do have three signatures and I put three little um, tab folders here. What's kind of cool is we work in a hospital. So I have um, history and physical, I have the immunization and also um, consultations as, um, as our little um, folder tabs. So when I kind of come through, I'm trying to do this sort of page by page. And um, so this is actually um, uh, like a, a beaded tape. And then I have this little card. And one of the things that I did is I incorporated some um, vintage baby products, baby food, as well as infant, vintage infant formula, because we would think that that was funny in, in here. And so um, I did some tea staining and um, this is actually with a um, kind of ancient um, Easter egg dye that happened to just be in my refrigerator and I would not actually use it on food because it's expired, but it works great for paper. And um, so I incorporated a bunch of different things in here. And so here's a little vintage, sweet little vintage image of a mother and baby. I did some stamping as well. And this, this is a little sticker. And I kind of did a little, a little um, band for the tickets. This is actually um, something that we use here in um, the hospital that I work at. And um, another little sweet little stamp. This is actually from Target and it's a little notebook and um, with the donut and um, I incorporated that in. I put the little vintage chocolate and um, there's a little um, paper die cut heart and some um, kind of paper dolls. And I thought that this kind of coordinated with the back of this, this image here, a little game card. I just loved this paper. I love that. Um, love that. I'm going to kind of see if I can adjust this light a little bit. Maybe mm -hmm. a little, little dimmer. That's better. So when it's time to feed, when it's time to wean the baby, well, what are we going to do when we wean the baby? Uh, feed them Cairo syrup. I do not recommend that. People used to do that. Isn't that amazing? Um, this is actually kind of like a little um, kid's band-aid. And um, so this is some little stickers, um, more vintage baby food kinds of things, a little um, pocket, another little band here, and this card here. Pull this out. It's kind of sweet little bakery. Who doesn't like to eat goods? And I apologize because I'm putting this back where it was living. It's kind of sucks. I apologize for putting that down. A little um, game piece. Um, more about um, vintage um, castor oil. Some mini and more vintage. Stuff. Cute little image. So, so 
I did this, this little um, napkin flip, and I took some uh, some uh, distress spray and just kind of spritzed that there. This is the back of the donut page. So, kind of kept this sort of on the simple side. This is a napkin that's part, the other part of where I did the little um, spritzing. That, that This is a very scary image to me. Um, I also incorporated some kind of fun little craft um, cards. These are from uh, Target. I believe they were um, like 60 different of these little cards. And I want to say they were like $3. So that was kind of fun. And this little envelope, I'm not going to pull that out. Trust me that there's a little um, package of some, um, some gel hearts. And um, just put a little bit more of that um, fabric kind of there. Um, I will be very honest in saying I kind of miscalculated how to um, to sew in my signature. So I kind of used that to sort of cover that up and um, tried to make it into something pretty. And this is a little memo book that I actually found. And it's um, from like the 1940s. I know this because on the inside, um, it talks about um, Min L. Matheson as being the director of the ILGWU. Okay, remember the look for the union label? Well, that was the era where that um, woman was the um, president of that union. So, um, a little bit of like a washi tape. And then this is the story. So, the second signature is um, mostly the story. And I'm going to kind of clip through that a little scale on the baby with Michelle the nursing toddler and um see I'm doing fine on Robinson's baby food I've got another little um I'll pull that out but um there's a little a little card that's in there um a little stamping and just um just for a little bit of color this is um found some of these cards and they just have different um, adjectives that says sweet. So when, absolutely, she's sweet. Her family is sweet. There we go. And again, just kind of like some stickers and just some things to kind of keep it, keep it kind of fun. And a little pocket card. Um, like making like little jams. And so, there's another little, little pocket for a little um, vintage baby food ad that I kind of made like into a little tag. And kind of showing how the little story, the sweet little nursing image. Um, just kind of thought this little image of the lightning bug was kind of cool. Can you believe that milk was the only food that you ever had when you were a baby? Super sweet, love it. Baby growing up and becoming a little toddler and having little temper tantrums. Sometimes maybe we go to the beach and kind of put that in there. This is actually just a little um, stick note. I thought that was kind of fun to kind of put that in there. Um, there's a little kind of card. It's supposed to be a stand-up card table card for like teachers, but um, I thought it was kind of fun to kind of put that in there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Some like little pom-poms, just to give it a little bit of lift. Um, do you hold your babies? Frequent doctor's visits. Well, you know, maybe you should pay attention to the different kinds of formula that um, Mead products, I think I mentioned became Mead Johnson. There's kind of like the colors of this little thing for the camp. Yummy foods. Ooh, I'm trying to turn the page. And go into the zoo. I'm going to turn that page again. So we'll still, we'll still have love when you're done nursing. And I incorporated this kind of cool little journal card. A little vintage lady. So. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Try and turn the page. And, 
And this is the end of the story. Um, like I said, it was kind of published by La Leche Lee. And so now this next signature is all going to be um, just like little papers and stuff. I thought that was really, really pretty. A little, little card, little stamp, and a little image. Um, so I put the um, button and a little um, charm. And it was kind of nice to incorporate this little um, little dream catcher. And the baby should have a little bit of a dream catcher. Um, this is just some stamping. I kind of did down down the little edge. Um, be sure to take Nestle's baby food when you go on vacation. Here's another one of those little um, cards for suggestions on making some crafts. And a little um, card. It's um, Fisher Price Little People. And I just kind of stapled a little note card there. Um, and some little, little paper dolls here. So, melons, baby food. Don't think I'll give you this anymore. Here's another thing from our hospital. That will be very familiar. Some ladies. And some fun papers. This is actually in this little belly band is um, just stuff about um, making your own baby food. And I really kind of like this. Every summer has a story. And it kind of pulls out with the dog. And on the back, it has, um, I want to say this came from Daphne's, um, the, the Daphne's magazine. And then there's some um, little journaling space. Now, my friend, um, she worked on an organic farm. And I was just recently at a organic grocery store. And I found this little coloring book about this farm. And I just kind of incorporated that in. I think my friend will really like that. Um, so, coloring pages and information about the farm. Um, so I put some little stickers here um, for that little vegetable basket. Just a couple of these pages here I sort of decorated, but this is just that little, little coloring book. So my friend has a tattoo of a bean plant and that looks like a bean plant to me. I think that she will be so entertained by by that um, just little kid stuff about sustainability don't be a litter bug let's use solar panels on the farm and just all of that kind of good stuff you know put a little sticker here in that little basket where it looked like it was lettuce um and a little sticker here for the pig why not that was kind of fun and uh yeah, so that's for the that, and I guess that farm's been around for like 20 years. So um, I thought that this little border was really pretty, and I kind of glued these little fabric flowers in this little um, doily and some pretty paper. And cute little clip, little, little belly band for a little journaling card. And um, we live in Maryland, so if I kind of pull this up, this is actually a little playing card, but um, it is a State of Maryland um, playing card. And this is also some stamping that I did. Who doesn't like rainbows? I'll put that with a little clip. And this is some really pretty paper. More weird baby ads, you know, feed your baby carnation milk. Nobody do that anymore, please. Um, a kind of weird shaped old bottle advertisement. Um, and another, another little clip. I put some of these little cards. These are actually from, the, from Dollar Tree. And uh, Grown on Wind and Sunshine. And um, just, this is kind of, kind of fun paper. And more sort of a vintage ad so that tea stained. And some perfume. And a little apricot jam and another little like a little bunny and um and this is also some of that um i want to say it's tim holtz distress spray just kind of spritz that um this entertains me because that looks like baby poop to me and i just think that's hilarious um and probably she will too a little butterfly and so that is the end of michelle the nursing toddler hope you enjoyed my flip through